I'm Michelle Sullivan and I have celiac disease and I live the gluten-free lifestyle. Who would have thought that you were allergic to food? The things that are good for other people are not good for me. I gotta be special because I can't do what everybody else is doing. If I accidentally eat it, I will get sick. I used to sit on the toilet eating my food. Everything ain't gluten-free. A lot of times there's nothing you can eat. There's a doctor in Joliet. Her name is Michelle Sullivan. She became a celiac specialist. Just meeting her, you knew she knew more about it than any doctor. Really, I felt so horrible. You know, she said, well, my husband and I both went through this at the same time. Plus she has a family that experiences that. Both parents celiac and all the children celiac. She's helped me so much. That's where my life began to be saved. Hi, I'm Michelle Sullivan. I have celiac disease. I am a family physician. I went to medical school in Old Westbury, Long Island. Um, met my husband there, as a matter of fact. We have three of four children now that have celiac, and we lost a baby to untreated celiac, uh, and that propelled me into wanting to do this full time. My husband and I took the bull by the horns and went out and started lecturing. We felt it was really important to start teaching gluten intolerance, gluten sensitivity. You know, it doesn't have to be that way. Life is going to be great. And there are so many restaurants that you can go out to. Eating out, being away from home, is the hardest part for us. To walk in and smell all that good food. But it's the way it's cooked. Cross-contamination. I walked out of a restaurant because they said, well, we're gluten-friendly. Of the restaurants don't have a separate kitchen. I don't trust them. We go to the same restaurants all the time because we found that they're safe and we don't get sick. There was no information out there for me. You're, you're really out on your own. Going on TV and looking for something that's relatable, I found that there isn't anything out there. There's nobody addressing gluten-free cooking and gluten-free lifestyle for those who have no place else to turn. It's homemade and I know that it's gluten-free when she makes it. She just walked me through it. Do you trust a school cafeteria to prepare your kids gluten-free foods? Is he going to be safe? Is the kitchen going to be prepared? Through this show, I am hoping to reach all of you out there that don't feel like you can cook your normal foods at home, that don't feel like you can visit a restaurant and feel safe. I am excited to meet the country's best chefs. I'm going to take their foods and teach you how to cook them in your own home. Food that people won't even know are gluten-free. Banana bread, zucchini bread, brownies, pastas. This is your new life. You're gonna eat differently. My heart goes out to those who are fighting this and not knowing where to go. She has become like a good friend and a good daughter. <laughs> she has the experience behind her, dealing with it herself. And she gives you hope that there is a life and you can eat and you don't have to sit at home just eating, you know, dry bread and peanut butter. Uh, for that, she's tops. All in all, this is the best doctor that God has put on this earth because she saved my life. <laughs>